All right, welcome back to Rain World Downpour. Didn't notice this last time, but yeah, we, we got the pixel. It's there, just in time for 5P. And we have a bit of a trek ahead of us if I want to do this all in one go, which I think I want to try and do. So let's try and just go quickly here. Maybe I also have a longer cycle or something. I didn't notice how long my cycle was last time. So we might get lucky, we might not. But let's try and go quickly. Oh, come on. I guess that's why this is here. Thought the anti-gravity was stronger here. So yeah, I'm not gonna hibernate here. Uh, I guess I will go in. Yeah, because it's not even on the map. Oh, I mean, it is on the map, but like, yeah, let's make sure it's properly there. So you can see it. Whoa, there was still like anti-gravity here. That's surprising. I guess it's still, like, relatively close, yeah? And now it's, like, wearing off. Oh! Where did you go? O okay. I don't know what you thought you would get in here. This is not really a good trap place. Oh, and there's a yellow overseer as well. So yeah, there was a blue lizard here. I gotta be wary of. Where is the blue lizard? I mean, I did take a little while to get down here, so maybe it spawns like further down. And we could try dropping down further as well, but I kind of don't want to do that. Like, right here, I can drop down. Allegedly, it's probably just one, like, death screen. Just, like, an empty one. But yeah, so let's get the popcorn here. Thanks for the warning. That was, like, actually useful. For once in their life, they don't just point out, like, a blatantly obvious threat. Like, hey, did you see that there's a vulture eating you right now? We have two yellow overseers. Thanks, Moon. Thanks for the moral support. God, these jumps, though, are very scary. Uh, bird? Whoa! Holy shit! And there's the blue. What do I do about that? Hey, blue. Yeah, warning. I guess we have to go up here and try and take care of it. Stay there. Don't move a muscle. Thank you. Oh, God. I'm going to miss one of these jumps at some point. God. I'm just gonna do that because I want to play it safe. Why the music? Did I see a laser? Yep. There's a laser. Go quickly. Oh, shit. Don't go quickly. No. No, 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 no. I can't. I can't do this. I can't do it in time. I can do it in time. Holy God. Eat that guy, not me. Eat him. Take him. You can have him. It's fine. Nice. Good job, guy. Good job. Peace in our time. Holy shit. That is very lucky. 
That's very lucky. Thanks, cheerleading squad. I bet there's going to be a sign lizard somewhere here as well. Yeah, I hear... Oh, that's a vulture. Oh, crap. That was terrible. What the hell is wrong with me? Did he just come up on the right? All these little tiny nubs of poles sticking up above, that's like a big problem. They keep like messing you up. What are you doing? Oh, they're eating like an ambush bug, I see. can't have that. I mean, you could. I could just try and tame them, but I don't want to do that. And we do have popcorn here for next cycle. Yeah, that, that wasn't that bad. It seemed like it was going to take much longer, honestly. But yeah, actual good hibernation. Like, reminder, if you haven't played Artificer at this point, I mean, can you? I don't know exactly what the unlock order is, but yeah, it's good. So let's definitely check in here so if I go out and then check it oh hold on there we go remembered if I go out and check it the region should be waterfront right I'm pretty sure a lot of death this might be our most like violent playthrough which is surprising coming after coming from uh, Artificer. I guess I would have to compare who gets the most kills. What was that? Like Saint and something? I forget. But we do get Nomad, but that's gonna die again. So now I'm in Waterfront. Yep. Yeah, thought so. So we should be able to like go down this way, I guess, and link up to something. Or could you not do that? Was that only later or something? I think the the screen down there might still be pointless, but uh, yeah, we can't check unlocks. I forgot to check. Like, do we still have unlocks here in Waterfront that I need to worry about? Regardless, I don't want to stay here for too long. I just want to get over to 5P again. Scavengers, hello. Hey, what's up, guys? You want some spears? Enjoy! Best of luck! Don't let the ambush bug bite! Oh, sorry, guy. My bad. Yeah, I'm just gonna check down here really quick. Actually, I'm, I'm doing it now, but it would have been better to check how much karma we need for the the gate first, so I know. Oh, oh, that was so bad. I saw that like in right when he moved, I was like, oh, that's an ambush bug, and just didn't have any reactions whatsoever. Yep, yeah, that was pretty lame. It was like one of the more obvious ambush bugs as well. Oops. Uh, so yeah, let's, since we're, hello, yeah. Since we're here, let's just like quickly go and check that I don't need like high karma to enter here. No. It's fine, so I'm gonna go and check it. Just in case there's any unlock or whatever. Probably a pearl, but like I don't think I wanna bother with the pearls right now. But it might be nice to 
memorize, if so, if there is a pearl. Nope, we don't need to go there. It's fine. Yeah, I blame the scavengers. They were, like, distracting me last time. What are you doing? Uh, I don't even need to, like, use white spears right now because we have the popcorn I can just go and grab. It's just lizards? Do I care? Oh god, what have I done? Why am I doing this? Okay. I thought I could, like, do slide, slide spears or something, but yeah, they just kind of showed up across, like, five different locations. I do want to go here, though, just in case. Let's see. There's still three gray unlocks, a broadcast. Yeah, there could very easily be a broadcast out here. That would just make sense. So I'm going to keep doing it. We don't need karma anyway. It's fine. Also, the fact that I have, like, max karma, was that because of Moon? I don't think I noticed, or maybe I was just, like, I have been hibernating a lot without dying. I'm not sure if that was it, or if... I think someone mentioned that Moon, like, feeds you if you need it. But I'm not sure if she also, like, caps out your karma. To be nice. Watch out, guys! Yeah. I'll take care of it. Again, guess I don't need... Oh, what have you done? No! No! Fuck you! Dude! <sighs> Scavengers, man. Moon, could you, like, send these guys away? I don't feel like we really need the surveillance right now. What is the best way to deal with these guys? This maybe? I'm gonna get reported for hacks. This is perfect. Oh my god. Cheat spot. They can't do anything. Stop twitching, this guy. You're scaring me. I guess they went home. Went into their dens. But then, wait, how do I... Is this one? Yeah. Surely broadcast right here. Yeah. I mean, that's obvious, right? Live broadcast, private. Seven red suns, no significant harassment. SRS, do you know how I sent this sensitive information last time? It certainly wasn't over the broadcast network. I... Purposed a messenger and sent the information by land via a data pearl. How original of you. Haven't we seen this? I've read this. Oh, right. Yeah. I have read this because they're in sequential order. This proves it that, like, it is just an order. It doesn't matter where you get them. And because I loaded my backup from after I got the one on Phi P's wall, we're getting this now. 
now if I get to 5P's wall and grab that one, we would get the next one. So, yeah, I don't need to read this, but that's good. Again, I will need to, like, go back here after 5P as well. And yeah, you could go around, like, every region and collect all of the broadcasts first, but since you get all of them anyway, and I can just read them in the, uh, the collection, I feel like as long as I get as many as I can on the way, if I want to collect all of them after that, it's just going to be so much nicer to, to not worry about a full completion of the world first. Yep, just want to see the screen. Uh-huh. There we go. Alright. Now we should be able to... to leave. Now, how do I jump up here? I did it in an adrenaline-induced moment, but it's kind of... kind of tricky. There we go, that's better. What are you fighting? Oh, these guys. Oh, no. Don't kill me on the way up. Scavengers? Don't do it. Oh, God. I gotta go fast before they, like, show up here. Don't... don't do it. Guy, don't kill the overseers. Don't do it. Don't kill them. What are you doing up there, guys? What the hell is wrong with you? Oh, hi. I'm just gonna do this. Oh. No! You fucking asshole! Holy shit, I hate scavengers! God, why do I keep friends? Th these are not my friends! You had one job! If you had just, like, hit that fucking chameleon, I could have, like, backed you up. Oh my god, they're so annoying. For fuck's sake. Well, we got the broadcast. That's fine. I guess I'll just go eat some popcorn instead, but fucking hell. They really should, like, have better coding for, like, oh, this trajectory is right in line with our friend, the slug cat. We shouldn't do this. Because they do with each other, right? Like, I've never seen another scavenger kill a scavenger. Or maybe I have, like, in a freak accident, but never... Never this frequently. It's like they just tunnel vision so hard on these overseers, and it's very frustrating when you should allegedly be their friend, and they're just so fucking clumsy all the time. Oh boy. But yeah, we should be fine in terms of uh, karma. I can't remember... Like, am I- am I gonna go all the way up the wall again? Is that better? Or... Do we take the underhang path? I might wanna take the underhang path? I don't know. I don't know what's best. I kind of- initially I wanted to take the underhang path because then, oh, I would get a neuron on the way before I go into 5P, but... It's kind of unnecessary now, now that I have the pixel and the neuron, but... I guess there's still, like, collectibles and stuff there. But he's just gonna throw me out anyway. So I'm, I'm not too sure. Do I hibernate here? I feel like I can be a little greedy. And try and get to that underhang spot instead. I don't know. That might be greedy. Oh wait, is that something up there? Like, it wasn't unlocked, but is there a new one here? No. I don't know what these, like, grey dots, like this one, right above me, there's like a grey dot on it. Does that mean it it is a collectible I haven't collected, but it's for a different slug cat? Or is it like, it's a collectible for a different slug cat that I have collected? Or... I'm not sure exactly how that works. So there, there shouldn't be Daddy Long Legs around, right? But there could be other horrors. Oh, uh, that was the wrong spear, and I guess I didn't even need food anyway, so that was just a mean moment. 
Oh no, and I'm gonna pay for it. Crap. Oh god. Oh man, that... Him just stealing that spear, like, messed me up completely. I was trying to, like... Come on, man. At least make use of me. Yeah, I was just trying to, like... Hit him with a spear, and then while he was momentarily stunned, just very quickly... Get behind him and spear him again, but yeah. Just stole my spear, and then I couldn't do that. Areas like that are just so awkward to fight lizards in. Like, it's so difficult when the train is inconsistent and blocky and has a bunch of weird elevation and not a lot of, like, flat ground. And again, maybe it's better to have a rock in these situations. If cyan lizards are gonna be, like, the main threat here, then a rock is very nice. I'm gonna try it one more time. Like... Let's try skipping the hibernation point one more time. See if I can just get over to underhang. If I can't, then I will hibernate there. Because, yeah, I just feel like this hibernation point isn't really that useful anyway. Like, it's not much better. Especially, the only thing we cut out is, like, going through one gate, and that's it. And I mean... The gate is nice to skip, but it's not a big deal. I wonder where that cyan is. Holy shit! I didn't see this guy! God damn. The screen's like so tall that it's hard to keep an eye on the the ceiling as well. Oh god. Oh dear. Can't beat it. You can't beat good old rock and stick. Hi. Hey, can you, like, see me or something? This is very awkward. What do we do? Guy. There's no way I can just, like... Just slip past him? What? Oh my god. Least aware chameleon in existence. He's just chilling. Yeah. Just a calm little chameleon. Alright, please no science up here. I think someone mentioned like an interesting detail about where we're coming up. Which I wanna see. Half time, yeah. It's awfully quiet so far. I kind of don't like that because it seems ominous. Like, something's gonna go wrong pretty soon. And there's 5P's overseer. Not sure if there's, like, orange lizards and stuff here now. 
yeah, there's something up above. Thanks for the warning. And yeah, the the marker is gone. Because yeah, apparently, like, canonically, it's Spearmaster that's, that, like, makes that symbol for other slug cats, I guess, to point down, like, hey, there's, there's hibernation here. I mean, obviously, it's just because no one found this hibernation point, and they had to, like, add a marker to help with people, but yeah, that's, like, the way it's explained, I guess, that it's not here for Spearmaster, but he was first, and made sure, because, like, this is a very hard hibernation point to get to. He just, like, noted that for all other slug cats in the future. It's kind of interesting. We do have Nomad. I, I don't think I can do anything with that, though. Like, I can go into 5P and then hibernate, but then I'm stuck. I can't get to a fourth region in one life. That's just not gonna happen. But yeah, good progress. I guess I'm gonna see if we can go all the way up top, but as far as I remember, we need one Karma above where I am to get into 5P, like, the regular way. But do I want to do that? Like... There shouldn't be much rot, so I guess it would be kind of interesting to see 5P's region. Oh, I don't know. There's pros and cons to this. I do want to see 5P's region, but at the same time, if I go in that way, it's going to be much harder to do the thing where I, like, make sure I get both the, the eye from the Overseer and the Pearl. And then if I don't, I have to reset, and it's much easier to reset when you're up top at the wall instead of here, so... Oh boy, I don't really know. I'll have to think about that until next time. If I even want to bother with that. Yeah, I, I'm not so sure. I might just want to climb up the wall and get the broadcast again, get up and do that, and then I guess like on the way down, we can go in the bottom side again, assuming everything goes well, which it won't, but... I don't know. We'll see. But thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.